Hello everyone and thanks for tuning back in Alessandro the Crypto here. I hope you're doing all fine. So welcome to this uh, update video on the Bitcoin price. We're going to analyze what is going on right now because we are seeing a potential initial dump towards our $11,000 bearish target. And also in this video, we're going to select the winner of our weekly $10 worth of uh, Bitcoin sponsored by BitYard. So BitYard is the number one exchange if you want to trade Bitcoin and other cryptos up to 100x leverage only owning Tether. So if you have some Tether on the sideline, make sure to go down below here in the video description and sign up with my link that you find down below here in the video description on BitYard. You don't need KYC, nothing, just your email address. You can top up some tether and immediately you can start trading whatever you want even derivatives you can trade here and what we're seeing currently here on the bitcoin price is this possible dump and lo losing the support here of eleven thousand three hundred dollar we had already here an hourly week below the support we came towards eleven thousand one hundred seventy and this dip immediately got bought back up which of course is a very bullish sign and that's why i think if we are coming down to this region here of around eleven thousand dollar where we previously also had here resistance and then it turned out into new support. I think there we, that we have very good chances to have a big bounce to the upside once we're going to close the CME gap that we have down at $11,000, approximately $11,100. But I think if we're coming down to these levels, most likely we will also touch the $11,000 price level. And what we're going to do on this update video is we're going to focus on the CME chart and of course also have a look if you want to open up a new short or long position here on BitYard with some tether what are the good entries because currently it looks like that we have here another little breather to the upside before maybe we continue to go lower towards our CME gap because watching here at the CME chart in the one hour time frame you can see that after we open up again the market this morning we have seen a little pump which right now after having this little bearish divergence currently we're having a correction down to the 20 moving average and if this moving average is getting lost then watch out here for the 50 moving average at exactly eleven thousand one hundred dollar where also our cme gap is lining up and that's why i think it is very likely that we will see in the next coming hours here this gap filling coming up and the worst case scenario is that we maybe don't stop here but continue to trade lower maybe even towards the 200 moving average in one hour before then we are having another bounce to the upside and the 200 moving average here it's currently at 10,840 so it's even possible that we could have a major dump towards this price and then we're going to see a big bounce to the upside because here in the one hour time frame we still have our, a lot of room left to the downside as you can see currently we are bouncing from the 50 level in the rsi but if here we're going to test this price level once more or maybe two three times more we're going to potentially have here a drop towards this eleven thousand dollar and maybe even a couple of hundreds of dollars less and this is of course what we have to uh, wait and see once we're reaching these levels and also once the cme gap is getting filled here but if you want to open up long positions and maybe wait till this future gap is definitely getting filled and you can also dca you long down to ten thousand eight hundred dollar if you think that we will have a big bounce to the upside which in my opinion is very likely to come but as long as we're not feeling this fresh new made gap that we have here, I would wait to open up new longs. If you already are longing since uh, $10,500, then you should be fine. Just raise up your stop loss potentially here towards this $11,000 or maybe even higher in case that we're really dropping down and then you can look for new positions. Otherwise, taking profits up here, of course, it's not a bad idea as well. And now if we go over into the four hour time frame here, also you can see that currently we could be in here for a possible gap filling. You can see that we already had a wick, but we didn't even come down here to the 20 moving average, which most likely will get tested if we're coming down to close this gap. And there is also where we could see a potential bounce to the upside. This 20 moving average in the four hour is currently right here at 11,000. 
dollar and also why I think we could potentially come down to this level and maybe even go lower towards the 200 moving average here also at $10,860 is because here very soon I'm getting a sell signal in my own indicator and that's why I think very likely we will see in the next couple of hours and maybe even days till the end of the week here a bit of a correction before we're gearing up here for another big move to the upside. But so far we don't have here a sell signal but most likely will get triggered pretty soon and if you also want to get these signals make sure to contact and also join me over on discord the link is down below here in the video description and now let's have a look also into the daily time frame because currently here you can even see the gap that we have here down to eleven thousand one hundred dollar where also the 50 daily moving average is lining up here in the cme chart and here we still have a lot of room left to the upside. You can see that the RSI just started to trade here above the 50 level and also in my own indicator here we have a lot of room left before we could eventually see a sell signal. So, so far I think even though we could see a possible pull back down to this region down here, maybe even towards the 20 daily moving average, which is also coinciding with a very important support here at 10,890. I think there most likely we're gonna see another big bounce to the upside and potentially go and test again 12k if right now we're coming down to cool off a bit and also close this freshly new made CME gap that we created over the weekend and don't forget that it's still not too late if you want to take this short opportunity you still could get in here into a very nice position to ride it down towards eleven thousand one hundred dollar if you go for example with a 20x or 10x here on a bit yard with some tether you can easily gain and multiply your dollars here and once the price is bottoming out and you think it's going up again with this tether for example you can go long again here or just use it to buy more Bitcoin for example and uh, Bityard the more you trade the more bonus you get up to $258 so make sure to use the link and sign up down below here in the video description to Bityard this is really the number one exchange if you want to trade with Tether you can even trade gold oil for example here and uh, you can tune in every day you can claim some free Tether as well here just go where it says daily mining and cl click here on mining and you get instantly some Tether as well. All right, guys, so that's it for the small Bitcoin update. And now let's select our lucky winner of this uh, Bitcoin giveaway that we did weekly so far. And this was always sponsored by Bityard. So as you can see, my uh, wallet here is getting to the end. So this is really now the last giveaway that we're doing that is sponsored by Bityard. And the next giveaways that we will do, I will not stop doing giveaways. So the next giveaways that we will do is worth of $50 worth of Bitcoin. And we're gonna do this $50 worth of Bitcoin with every 1000 subscribers here on YouTube. So that's why it is very important everyone out there that is still not subscribed here to the channel. And, and if you also want to get these daily TA videos on the Bitcoin price, make sure to subscribe to the channel. Also share the videos with your friends and uh, with every 1000 subscriber to say thank you for all the support. I will do a $50 worth of Bitcoin giveaway. So make sure to subscribe not only here on this live stream on Twitch, but also over on YouTube or in my main channel. And now let's see who is the lucky winner of this last $10 worth of Bitcoin. First off, we're gonna have to see how many comments that we got in this video. So let's see, we got finally 142 comments and now let's select our lucky winner that will win here the rest, almost $10 worth of uh, Bitcoin. And the winner is uh, Greeky N, uh, it's cool. Yeah, thank you very much my friend and uh, you are the lucky winner of our last $10 worth of Bitcoin giveaway sponsored by Yard. So the next giveaways I will do with every 1000 subscribers on YouTube and that giveaway is gonna worth every time $50. So congratulations to you my friend and uh, I hope you're gonna hodl it till the end and for everyone that didn't win this time 
make sure to tune in every day in my daily TA videos on YouTube and also here on the live streams on Twitch. And then the next giveaway will be when we're gonna reach 2000 uh, subscribers. So thank you very much for your support, my friends. And uh, don't forget, if you still want to take this uh, trade, which most likely gonna take us down here towards $11,000 and there maybe you can get a very nice long opportunity if we have a nice bounce from this price level after filling this CME gap that we have right now, you are still not too late. You can still subscribe right now here to Bityard, open up an account, put some tether. It's everything very instant and you can immediately start to trade here without even having those coins. So with that said, guys, I'm gonna wrap it up for now. Thank you again very much for watching and congratulations to the lucky winner. We're gonna see us all in the next ones, my friends. Bye.